Good morning, everybody. Today is voting day. Last night was a rough night for me. I had slept all night long, woke up to go to the bathroom, looked at the clock, and it was only 1.30 in the morning. <laughs> I tossed and turned up and down. I didn't sleep well last night, but here we are. Today is the day. It is voting day. And I know a lot of you are heading out to cast your votes today. You plan on using your voice today. And so I wanted to send you off with a little bit of motivation. Ladies and gentlemen, when the Republican Party of Georgia moved Herschel Walker from Texas to Georgia so that he could run for Senate, it's because change was taking too fast in the post antebellum South. The state had been flipped blue and there are some principalities that were not prepared for a black man and a Jewish man to go to Senate at the exact same time. So they figured that they would delude us by picking somebody who they thought would in fact represent us better with a football than with a degree in philosophy. They thought we were so slow, that we were so stupid, that we would elect the lowest caricature of a stereotypical broken black man as opposed to somebody who is educated and erudite and focused. Y'all ain't ready for me today. Since Herschel Walker was 16 years old, white men been telling him what to do, telling him what school to go to, where to live, where to eat, where to buy a where to run, where to sit down, where to sleep, where to pay for abortions, where to buy a gun. And they, you think they're not going to tell him how to vote? In 2022, we don't need a walker. We need a runner. We need somebody who's going to run and tell the truth about January 6th. We need somebody who's going to run and push for the cancellation of student loan debts. We need somebody who's going to run and make the former president respond to a subpoena. We don't need a walker. We need somebody who will be steadfast, unmovable, always abounding, knowing that your labor is not in vain. Georgia, I need you to know the slave Negroes y'all are used to don't live here no more. We can think for ourselves, function for ourselves, and vote for So now, grab your cup of coffee. Yesterday we talked about making a plan. So make sure you have all of the things that you need in case you have to stand in a long line. Also, we talked about being safe. Be aware of your surroundings at all times. If things ain't looking right, if things are looking violent, find another way. Go on, you got this, be safe, I'll see you later.